Hey guys, what's up? It's David here from CLE Fan 7 Autos uh, with a two package GTML day uh, recap for Thursday, October uh, 17th, 2013. Uh, <laughs> first TTM video in a long time. I can't even remember the last time I had a TTM video. It's probably over the summer. But um, yeah, baseball season's pretty much done now. I mean, I haven't even made a video in like three weeks, four weeks. A lot's happened since then. Uh, Indians made and got knocked out of the playoffs. So uh, I'll talk about that in the end. I'll just get into TTMs right now. But uh, so you yeah, had two package TTM LD, uh recap. Uh, one came in on Tuesday and one came in today. Um, both are Arizona Diamondbacks successes. Uh, two of their best players. Uh, everybody's been getting them back, it seems. So uh, you guys should probably know who they are. So uh, we'll get into it first. Uh, with the first one. Coming back from New Orleans, Louisiana. Um, oh, by the way, I didn't even look at the the amount of days it took. Um, both our spring training successes. Um, so uh, we're gonna say at least two hundred days. Um, uh, first one is Diamondbacks pitcher was one of the best young pitchers in the league last year. I didn't really check his stats to see how he did this year, but to wait. Oh shoot. <laughs> okay, all right. I didn't damage the card, but it's uh, Wade Miley. Uh, personalized it to David. Uh, I really don't mind it. I would, of course, I'd prefer it without the personalization, but it's okay. So I signed in Blue Sharpie for the 2012 top set. I don't know what number it is. I didn't check, but really nice card. And then the next one, I think I sent this one out actually over last winter. Um, I think I sent it to the the stadium. I don't think it, I. This might even be longer than spring training, but Phoenix, Arizona. Probably, if it wasn't for Andrew McCutcheon this year, probably would be the uh, National League MVP. Very underrated based on the team he's on uh, because Arizona didn't make the playoffs the playoffs this year. So, Paul Goldschmidt, he's their first baseman. Uh, signed it. No, hold on. Okay, yeah. <laughs> signed it in black Sharpie. Um, very nice success. This is mojo in my opinion. Even the Wade Miley you could say is kind of mojo, but uh, this one definitely is right here. Um, I really don't care about Black Sharpie. The autograph came out flawless. There's real, real little, like, kind of fading right at this point right here, but I really don't care. This is a great success. So, really happy with that. So, uh, yeah, it's been, uh, it's been a while since I made my last video. Um, yeah, let's see. The Indians made the playoffs. Uh, of course, the loss to Tampa 4 to nothing in the wild card game. Uh, I thought Danny Salazar did okay. Uh, future definitely looks really, really bright for the Indians. Francisco Lindor should be up at some point next year, and uh, obviously with all this young talent, um, if we could just make a couple, couple moves in the offseason, get a nice um, cleanup hitter, and re-sign Ubaldo Jimenez and Scott Casimir. At least you got you got to sign one of them, preferably Casimir. But uh, so yeah, um, Browns Browns have been doing uh, okay. They're three and three right now. Um, Brandon Whedon's back at quarterback, so we're probably gonna suck now. Brian Hoyer. Was our quarterback, but tore his ACL, so that kind of sucks. But uh, so yeah, we'll see. Cavs are just about to start in a couple weeks. They're looking pretty sick this year. Uh, they lost to the Bobcats the other night in preseason, but it's preseason. They play again tonight. So, uh, yeah, it's basically that's basically what's been happening in my life with sports. Uh, my high school football team's looking pretty good. Probably gonna make the playoffs. Got a big game tomorrow night, so uh, I'll be definitely be there. So. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, guys, that's about it for me uh, today. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye.